China and Iran have urged all countries involved in the nuclear agreement with Iran to comply with the deal. The response from Iran and China came as the Iranian Foreign Minister Mohammad Javad Zarif visited his Chinese counterpart Wang Yi in Beijing on Monday. Our reporter Su Yuting has more. Iranian Foreign Minister Zarif is on official visit to China, accompanied with the large delegation of businessmen to boost economic cooperation. Foreign Minister Wang Yi extended warm welcome to Zarif, and the two ministers held the first annual China-Iran Foreign Ministers meeting. They discussed the milestone significance of President Xi Jinping's visit to Iran in January this year, with deals signed to increase trade worth up to 600 billion U.S. dollars in the next 10 years. Zarif also spoke about increased cooperation on energy, transportation, infrastructure, and counterterrorism. The two ministers agree to deepen cooperation for joint development within the framework of the Belt and Road Initiative. Speaking to the press after the meeting, they stressed that all parties should make joint efforts to continue to work for the smooth implementation of the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action. The Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action is an international agreement reached by the six countries with Iran. It's recognized by a UN resolution and the Security Council, therefore ensuring the full implementation of the agreement is the common and joint responsibility of all parties involved. It should not be affected by any change in the domestic situation of the countries concerned. The Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action was signed in July 2015 and went into force in January this year. The agreement lifted a variety of international sanctions in exchange for limitations on the Iranian nuclear program. Zarif said China played a constructive role in reaching the nuclear deal. Iran and China worked closely during the negotiation and the signing of Iran's nuclear agreement, and China played a critical role during the process. The Joint Comprehensive Plan for Action is a multilateral agreement, and all countries involved have an obligation to fully implement it. Iran will not allow any country to take unilateral actions that violate the agreement. Since the comprehensive agreement on Iranian nuclear issue was reached and took effect, China-Iran ties are embracing new development opportunities. The two sides have agreed to further implement the outcomes reached by President Xi Jinping's visit to Iran earlier this year and to boost connectivity and industrial capacity cooperation in the near future. Su Yuting, CCTV, Beijing.